Alright, yo, what is up guys and welcome back to another Boku no Roblox video. It's your boy AltGamerXD or Days back at it here in Boku no Roblox, the most OG game this channel will ever have. And apparently Boku no Roblox has a brand new quirk. I'm still very curious on how the quirk looks like. And the quirk that I'm talking about, the new quirk, is actually Mushroom. And, and that Mushroom quirk is actually from someone who is from Class B in the anime. And I'm pretty sure that she appears in the Season 5 of the anime if you guys haven't watched it already i recommend you guys watch it because it's really really good although i haven't finished the anime yet so um let's try to keep the spoilers away in the comments <laughs> but yeah i am very familiar with the mushroom quirk i've seen it in the anime basically it's like you know the girl summons mushrooms anywhere i can even recall that she even summons mushrooms on people so let's try to get it right now it's an uncommon quirk so it's not gonna be that you know rare and my expectations are not that high on this quirk since it's just an uncommon quirk but who knows maybe it's a hell flame level quirk because hell flame is really good and it's just an uncommon quirk so let's see let's try to get it right now Oh my god, I got explosion way before mushroom. Bro, why is this taking so much longer than what I expected? This is just an uncommon quirk. Just give it to me already, please. Oh my god. I'm literally very curious on how the mushrooms look like in the game. And I've seen a few sneak peeks in the Discord server, so I'm not sure. They said that it's not that accurate to the anime. But, you know, we, I still want to find out how it looks like. Because it's something that is new in the game. Bro, I got quirkless. Alright, there we go. We got Mushroom. Alright, so we got the Mushroom quirk and I am very clueless on how this quirk works. Why is my avatar smiling a bit? I'm pretty sure my avatar doesn't have that face. But yeah, let's see. 10 strength and 150 stamina. 2 times damage. User spouts a spore from their mouth towards the directed location causing a mushroom to spawn. Has higher chance of infection. Let's try it on an NPC actually. So does this do damage, I guess? Alright, it does. What the heck? There's actually a mushroom coming out. It literally looks like a tree. That's so cool. Oh my god, I wonder how much damage it does. Let's try to use it on the gym. The mushroom structure looks cool though. I like it. Look at that. Wait, why is it not growing? Is it gonna grow? Oh, so I have to click on it again. That looks so cool. It looks like an umbrella. <laughs> what the heck? Alright, so that's a Q move. So if I use it again, I have to click on it again to make it grow. Wait, no, it's not. I wonder how it works. I'm so clueless. Oh, so there's like different, uh, so there's like different designs of mushrooms. Yo, that's so cool. So I can spam this, I guess? Can I spam it? Yo, all right. So that's cool that they made uh, different designs of mushrooms. Look at this one. This looks so cool. There's like those uh, small circle things. I like it. Oh, this one's a red mushroom. This is the mushroom that I'm very familiar with. All right. Pretty good Q move, I guess, since it does two times damage. So, user teleports towards the nearest mushroom to their cursor or center of screen on mobile. All right, so I can teleport to the nearest mushroom. So, if I place one here, then I can... Ooh, all right. Also, there's like mushrooms uh, growing back on where I teleported from. So, like, if I do this again, Z, I can teleport there. All right, yo, that's actually really cool. Yo, I don't even think this is an uncommon quirk anymore just because of that skill. I think it's kind of similar to electric. Why is there mushrooms growing all over? What the heck? Alright, so if I do a uh, Q... Wait, what happens if like... Alright, there we go. Bro, there's mushrooms growing everywhere. What the heck is happening? So what happens if I use the Z skill if there's no mushrooms uh, nearby? Alright, so nothing happens. It only happens when there's like mushrooms nearby. So... Alright, that actually has a very long range. I think it's the same range as the all for ones teleport. Alright, this mushroom looks like a real mushroom now. That's so cool. Alright, so that's a Z skill. Basically, a teleport skill. And there's no damage to it. The next skill is the X skill. 50 in all stats. 600 stamina. Snap time. User decides they're hungry for a treat. Possible chance of health regen. Stamina regen. Damage boost. Speed boost. Or defense boost. Alright, so let's use the Q skill on Tomura. Boom. <laughs> Alright, there we go. So... We need to get damage at least 50%. The description said it heals you. And let's see if it actually does that. Yo, I actually like that animation. Oh, there you go. You actually heal from it. Alright, that's so cool. 
I like the animation where you eat the mushroom. That's so cool. That's something new in this game. What the heck? It kind of reminds me of the peppermint saber animation. All right. So for the C skill, I am not sure what it does. I haven't read the description. Let's read it. So for the C skill, 350 agility, 750 strength, 1000 stamina, viral infection. User spews a spore towards the directed foe. Upon impact, the foe is infected, causing damage over time. Chance of spore spawning from infection. All right. That sounds cool. I like it. Let's try to use it on an NPC. Let's use it on All Might actually. I hope All Might doesn't die too quick. So basically it does damage over time when I use the C skill. Alright, boom. Alright, yo, so oh my god, that actually does a ton of damage. It does continuous damage, so it's really good. And like mushrooms grow all over them, so I can use the Z skill to teleport. Alright, yo, that's actually really cool. Ah, right, there we go. Mushroom spawning all over All Might now. Let's use it again boom so that actually does continuous damage i like it i think it's gonna be really good for pvp actually if it's just auto aim but you know uncommon quirks are not that good in uh pvps but look at that i actually killed all might with just one c skill and i wonder how much damage that actually does overall to a player all right so let's let's move on to the next skill which is the v skill passive user cannot be infected infection infections displayed in red mist cause Causes the infected target to take damage over time. Depending on the ability used, it has chance to release spores which cause mushrooms to spawn. So basically, you cannot get damage from other mushrooms, I guess, since the user cannot be infected. Causes the infected target to take damage over time, depending on the ability used. Alright, so nothing happens when I use the V skills. Basically, just a passive. I don't know why All Might is naked there. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> oh. Alright, so for the F skill, the form, which is the fungal extremity. You just wanted to be a fungi er, or a fungal and decided to express your funginess, funkiness, <laughs> pun intended, has a 50% chance of spewing a spore each second dealing damage when standing near on an enemy. If I use this. Ooh. Wait, so if I walk around, mushrooms are gonna spawn all over? Yo, that's actually really cool. So, like, I get unlimited mushrooms, I guess? Yo, alright, I like that. I'm gonna spawn mushrooms all over the map now. I'm gonna turn this place into a mushroom land, I guess. Oh my god, what the heck? This is so cool. I can spawn mushrooms all over the place now. I can get this map crowded. What the heck? Look, there's even mushrooms floating here. Oh my god, what the heck is this quirk? I like this so much. So if I use the Z skill, then I can teleport there, I guess. Boom, alright. Yo, I think the Boku and Roblox developers need to change this quirk into a rare quirk because the quality of this uncommon quirk is actually really, really good and I think it's a contender for a rare quirk. So maybe change the rarity, I guess. Yo, this quirk is actually really, really good. I'm not gonna lie, I don't think this is an uncommon quirk anymore. Alright, that's my only recommendation to the Boku no Roblox developers. I think this quirk is too good to be an uncommon quirk, so change it to at least a rare quirk, I guess. Alright, so basically that's all the skills of the mushroom quirk. That's pretty cool, actually. I like it. This is the best uh, uncommon quirk, I think, so far. Or like one of the best uncommon quirks now. I actually like it so much. Boom. Look, I killed All Might in just uh, under 5 seconds. That's so cool. Alright, so that's the mushroom quirk, I guess. That's so cool. It's actually great that Boku no Roblox got 300 plus players when they released this quirk a while ago. And it's my first time seeing Boku no Roblox with over 300 plus players again. And usually they only get 200 plus players now, which is good because, you know, back in the day it only had like 100 players. So now I think Boku no Roblox is slowly growing again, hopefully, because, you know, I really want this game to grow again as a great my hero academia game here in roblox but yeah that's going to be it that's the mushroom quirk let me know what you guys think about this new mushroom quirk if you guys haven't tried it out i recommend you guys definitely try this out now because it's really really cool and it's really really fun to use maybe it's even really good for farming and you know traveling or just exploring i guess but yeah that's going to be it thank you guys for watching stay healthy and peace out